My name is Jenny and I wanted to let you guys know a little bit about my experience in using the GoFundMe website to help fund my fundraiser for Johnston County Animal Protection League in Johnston County, North Carolina. Um, my husband and I started out <laughs> with no pets at all and we ended up with three kittens from a neighbor and we had them for about a year and realized we still had plenty of love and time to take care of cats who um, didn't have families so we applied to be foster families which um, which we were accepted and we started fostering kittens and um, as sometimes happens um, when you foster um, sometimes you fail and then you end up with some more kittens um, anyway so I wanted to raise money for Johnson County Animal Protection League because not everybody, A, wants a cat, not everybody, B, wants multiple cats, and there are hundreds of, of cats being born every single day um, that don't have anyone to take care of them, and it's, it's a problem because um, they run around, they're completely feral and wild, they can get diseases, and then they can cause problems for um, companion pets. Um, so I set a goal for fundraising of $2,000. At this point, um, I am closing in on $900 raised, and it's the most wonderful feeling. Every time somebody makes a donation, especially when I don't know them, it just means so much. I feel like I really am making a difference. Um, and it's not for me, it's for, it's for animals who cannot take care of themselves and it's for the rescue organization that relies solely on um, volunteer funding. So um, my husband and I both are thrilled that we can do something to help, um, aside from just cleaning the cat cages and taking care of foster cats every now and again. Um, raising money really helps with the, the real day-to-day -day cost of taking care of um, sometimes close to a hundred foster animals. Um, so the reason I wanted to raise money was because I knew that people are willing to give but maybe they just don't have the impetus to give and I thought if I could um, start a fundraising campaign and start promoting it on Facebook and on Twitter and on email um, occasionally that um, people would find an extra few dollars and it turns out they really have and it's been it's been wonderful. Um, I found GoFundMe, I was looking for fundraising sites online and I found you um, come up number one on Google so that was a good thing. Um, so I immediately started with you guys. I like that it's so easy to set up that um, the fundraising page has its own URL that I can share with people, that you have um, the options to share every update that I give with Twitter and Facebook and also via email. It is a fine line to walk. You don't want people to feel like you're spamming them, but you also don't want them to forget you. So um, it's nice to have those tools and you can opt in to any of those three, Twitter, Facebook, or email, you can either say, yes, I want this update to go on Twitter, or no, I don't, same with email and Facebook, so that's really nice to have that flexibility. Um, a couple of things I didn't like. Um, <clears throat> I think that the site, it, it has, it feels a little um, staid to me, a little old-fashioned. It doesn't seem to have the same feel as a Kickstarter or a crowd rise. It's, I, I, GoFundMe is maybe just not as cool sounding, I don't know. Um, people seem to get really, really get behind Kickstarter um, campaigns and crowd rise as well. I don't know whether that's a marketing issue or what, um, but I, I do know that the, the, the cachet, for me, the cachet of the name recognition isn't quite as much. Um, that's just, you know, it's my personal opinion, and I still think it's a wonderful service or I wouldn't be here right now talking about how much I have appreciated um, the opportunity. And, you know, I didn't set an end date for my fundraising goal because um, I know that eventually um, I will get there. 
So almost halfway there now. And I chose $2,000 because officially at $2,000 I would have raised a ton of money. <laughs> anyway, um, I, yeah, I would recommend GoFundMe for anyone um, who is wanting to raise money. Um, I think it might be better for, for a, a specific length of time. You know, we have four weeks to raise X amount of money and, and maybe with an end date people would feel a little more urgency to give. But um, I certainly would recommend it. I think it's been a great experience. Um, I appreciate the tools that are available on the website to help me get the word out. And I know that um, Johnson County Animal Protection League has really appreciated the support. And I also know that, that the cats have as well. And I can look at them and when they have to go to the vet or just get flea medication or food or litter or anything, I know that some of the money that I helped raise um, has gone to that. And it has been a wonderful feeling. So anyway, thank you so much for the opportunity. And um, thank you for the time. I hope you have a great day. Bye.